So, given information is given that LM is parallel to DC and LN is parallel to CD. Then next, if you consider this triangle ABC in triangle ABC, LM is parallel to BC. According to basic proportionality theorem, we will get that if one side divides the if one side is parallel to the third side, then it divides the other two sides in equal ratio. So, as per that rule, we will get AM by MB is equals to AL by LC. Then next, we will do the reciprocal of this. So, MB by AM is equals to LC by AL. Now we will add 1 on both sides. So add 1 on both sides. So MB by AM plus 1 is equals to LC by AL plus 1. Then next AB Banza MB plus AB by A sorry it is AM <coughs> Z equals to LC by AL plus AL vanza AL. So here we will get AM plus MB. It will be AB by AM. Z equals to LC plus AL. It will be AC. AC by AL. This is our first equation. Now we will consider the next triangle that is ACD. So in triangle ACD, if you see LN is parallel to CD, then this line divides the other two sides in the same ratio. So we will get AL by LC is equals to AN by ND. AL by LC is equals to AN by ND. We will do the reciprocal of this. So we will get LC by AL is equals to ND by AN. Then next we will add 1 to both sides. So add 1 on both sides. So LC by AL plus 1 is equals to ND by a n plus 1 the next a l vanza l c plus a l by a l is equals to n d plus a n vanza a n by a n the next a l plus l c we will get a c by a l is equals to ND plus AN plus ND, we will get AD divided by AN. Then next we will do the reciprocal of this. So AL by AC is equals to AN by AD. This is our second equation. Then next here also we will do the reciprocal again. So it will be AM by AB is equals to AL by AC. This is our first equation. The next from 1 and 2. We will get AM by AB is equals to AL by AC which is equals to an by ad the next we can directly write first and last so therefore am by ab is equals to an by ad 